good morning and welcome to today's upload. My name is Emma, make sure you stick around for hauls and vlogs and chats. I recently uploaded like an Easter house tour if you want to go and have a look at that. But we are full in Disney mode. By we, I mean me. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, you will know I was up at like five o'clock this morning doing a spreadsheet. I might show you my spreadsheet in this video. That'll be thrilling for you. So yeah, we're off to Walt Disney World in a few weeks. Um, I have decided that I like packing, but I do find it a bit stressful if I leave it to the last minute. So I had a chat with Stephen and I was like, I'm gonna pack a bit every week. We've got some, um, we've only got a few weekends until we go and we have got hectic family time. We've got Mother's Day weekend, so I'm doing something with my mum, and Stephen's doing something with his mum, and then we're doing something with me, because I'm a mum. And then we've got a fam big family party. Well, a little fam, but we've got a family party. Um, so that'll be a weekend gone. And then we're there. So what? So I'm going to pack little and often. I will bring you along with me. That's probably what the vlogs will be about for the next few weeks. Um, today we're going to be tackling my boy's stuff. Uh, he has... Got some new stuff which I'm going to show you and also he's got old stuff so if you are new here we were due to go to Spain October half term but we couldn't um, so luckily or unluckily I don't know but we have got some of the stuff that we never use because I bought it in the H&M sale so we've got that so I was really pleased I opened one of my cases and was like oh, we've got stuff to use so I can show you that show you the new stuff also guys I'm going to put you down for this because I don't know what you think of this I've got an idea. Now, since the last time I went to Disney World, I have become like a lot more confident in the way I look and my outfits and stuff. And I was thinking, I was talking to Erin this morning, she thought that it was a great idea, but Erin is an enabler and she will always agree with me because she's a good daughter. I was thinking of creating outfits I've just got so excited. Creating outfits, taking a photo, so when I get there, I know what ears to wear with what outfit, what bag to wear with what outfit, what shorts and shoes. Is this insane? Is this, it, I think it definitely is, as is the amount of highlighter I've got on my face today, I think it definitely is, but I think I'm gonna do it. And then I'll be able to flip through and go, right, today I can wear it, da 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 da, boop, 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 out the door. Running down Main Street. Let me know your thoughts in the comment. Um, I have put so much highlight on my nose, it looks like I've got like a little, I don't know, like a filter on or something. I haven't, it's just my face. Right, let's show you where I'm at. Okay, we have got my trusty packing cubes out. I am going dark blue for my boy and his packing, light blue for my girl and her packing. I have actually purchased my own ones and I will show you those in a video at some point and they are um, animal print ones, ooh. And I did say, ask if Stephen wanted one, um, he doesn't know but, so I might get him some and I just, they, the phrases they put on these things make me laugh so much. Wish you have a beautiful life. Well, thank you, packing cubes. So yeah, these are off Amazon. You can get, just type in packing cubes. There's all sorts of colors and variations and different types of sizes and stuff. So they usually come in a big pack. I got all of these at once. And um, so yeah, packing cubes, my boy. Here is some of the new stuff that I will show you. Um, and here is some of the stuff that's from storage that I will get out, so we've got some shorts. So I think what I'll do first is put these into piles first and then show you the new stuff so I can show you what I'm working with. Uh, and if you watch Jay Morrell, my talking hand is doing some talking today too. Here we go, so this is the stuff that we've already got. I piled it into shorts, t-shirts, pajamas, and um, swim trunks. Also, I don't know, maybe we'll do some Harry Potter. Harry Pottering whilst we're out there, so I've got that. Um, I will show you the little notes um, thing that I did whilst packing. Let me pull that up. 
So what I did on my phone was I made a list of all the stuff I thought the children would need and I, because Stephen does his own packing. I will pack the family's toiletries, but he does his own packing. I did get out his um, Disney t-shirts because we have those in storage and I got those in a pile for him. And I made a big, can we see the list? Um, so it's things like um, tops, shorts, skirts, you know, sandals or whatever. So what I do is I go through and the kids, because we're going away for two weeks, the kids will need, and you can wash over there, so if you are going and you don't want to buy this many clothes and you just want to wash whilst you're there, you can, they do have washing machines. So if you're there for two weeks, you could just take a week's worth of clothing and wash it. They also have Target over there, they have Uniqlo, which has some really, have I come out in a bit of a strange red rash? It's odd, isn't it? Or is it the camera? Or is it the, just the pure excitement of Disney? There are shops over there um, that you can grab stuff at, so don't worry, you know. You're not in the middle of nowhere, you're in Florida. Uh, it is not going to be cold whilst there, hopefully, so we won't need to pack any woolly jumpers or anything, so it, it can kind of fit in. And then this summer, uh, the summer clothes from this holiday will last the kiddos throughout the summer, hopefully, if we ever get any nights. I'm looking out the window, it's pitiful at the moment, it's drizzly. So yeah, made a big list. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put everything in piles and then when I've got everything that I think I need, I'm gonna tick them off and that will help me. I don't know, is this, am I over-organizing it? I don't know, but I'm just, I just love it. So um, let me show you the new bits and bobs. Okay, my friends, shall we have a little look? I've managed to not have my bra hanging off the, uh, the door. Uh, when we looked, actually my girl had, we had most of the stuff already for her, so that was really good. Didn't have to, I'm not sure we had to get anything new for her at all, maybe like a sun hat, and that was about it. My boy, however, has grown. These children, they grow and stuff, and you have to get them new things, and it's really like rude, but he has grown because um, if, you might remember, I like to do like the H&M stuff. Um, so some of the stuff was six to eight. He's nine, so we had to upgrade. And I am gonna say that some of the stuff, um, I don't know if it's some of the stuff here, but some of the stuff uh, I have bought them in a bigger size. <laughs> they can have it for next year as well. Let's just embrace it. So first of all, he doesn't have that many mini, you know, me and Erin have loads of mini ears. So I've got these from H&M. I got him some Yoda ears, I thought they were really fun. Um, they were 4 99 I picked him up a cute little Jurassic uh, Park t-shirt, 8 to 10. So this will last a good couple of summers, really, really like that. That was 7 99 It's quite a lot, isn't it? kind of wish I'd got these online, because if you are a H&M member, sometimes you get money off or whatever, but I didn't, so it's fine. Uh, I got this one, which is Spider-Man, and it's like sparkly, so he'll love that, and says Spider-Man on the back. Lovely bit of Marvel, and then I got him just this, this is only 4 99 Really nice, plain, vintage Marvel T-shirt. So that is good. Um, we popped to Primani. We're really struggling. We'd love um, any suggestions below. We're struggling for kind of like what I would call like going out top. So if we're going for like a nice meal or, I don't know, just like a nice top. Do people do that? You know, like just a nice top and shorts. I, but anyway, got some from Primark. Uh, this was three pound, lime, it was very bright. This was three pound as well. And Stephen has got something similar, just cute blue. Picked up some shorts. These were two packs, two shorts for seven pound, which is really good value. So got some navy ones, and as we all know, my boy is obsessed with tie dye. Tie dye. Stephen picked this t-shirt. This is two pound thirty. Um, it's kind of like a Hawaiian theme. I'm not going to try this one on like I did in the last vlog. He loved this. He was there when we picked this one. This is six pound. That's what I mean. Just like a couple of nice, like cute shirts that you might wear with like chinos. Am I really old fashioned? Is this the issue? Is that I am just old fashioned? And then, I think we've got some more shorts. 
these will last this year and next year just back and grey um, we got you know my girl always obsessed with bucket hats so she got herself a bucket hat I can't tell if I look terrible or brilliant. I'm going to go with terrible. <laughs> that was five pounds. And, oh yes, mini ears. We saw these mini ears in store. So if you are looking for mini ears and you don't want to pay um, park prices, they do often do them in Disney for three pounds. They're not as good quality as the park. However, I've had some, like... I don't know, for year, like nine years. So um, we picked up these ones. I can't put it on my head, but it's like cute little, little pink ones. These might be too small for my head, but I'm gonna wear them anyway. They're quite cute. Me and my girl got a pair of those each. So there we go, just some bits and bobs. Topping up Ethan's summer stuff. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to, I like to pack in outfits. So it will be like a short and a top. I'm not going to put underwear in because we won't pack that till the last minute because they'll still be wearing their underwear and we'll just wash it and take it with us. So I'm going to pack a shorts and a top for every day that we're there. You will need spare outfits, of course. Um, as I showed you, what I'm taking two pairs of swimming trunks. I'll take two pairs of pyjamas um, because two weeks just seems a long time to wear one pair of pyjamas. As I say, you can wash it up there though. I've had friends that have washed up there. So that is the next stage and I'm absolutely thrilled. I just love it. I love getting all the little outfits ready. And I know, I know, in a few years time, if I'm still doing this YouTube channel, I'm gonna be like, they do not want me to do their outfits. They want to just wear, I don't know, whatever is trendy at the moment. And I'll just be like, guys, do you remember back when I could roll up a pair of shorts and a and a Jurassic Park t-shirt? So I'm going to make the most of it whilst I can and in thoroughly enjoy it. Here we go, guys. So put them into little piles. Some of these are, this is Erin's old top, which you can now wear, which is brilliant. Um, these are age eight, but I got them to try loads of stuff on. They fit. The outfits that I really love are, <clears throat> I love these shorts. These are old uh, Zara. I got them in the sale last year. And this little t-shirt. I oh, how cool is that t-shirt? So that is a really nice outfit. Really like that one. And also, I really like this. Where was this? This is old Zara. And I got these um, shorts in the sale. But how fun is that for the little... Ensemble. So every day he's got shorts and a top to wear, and then I've got a few spare tops for if we want to go out in the evening, or you know, kids will be kids. I've learnt over my years of being a mum that an ice cream will be spilt down a shop. Uh, uh, somebody will fall over. They will always fall over, and I will actually do a video about packing my part bag as well, because I'll put all like show you what I pack in my part bag. You always need plasters. There's always going to be some sort of disaster with clothes, so you need to make sure you've got spares. Have a spare on the plane. All the things. So I'm now going to try and roll all these up into the packing cubes, and let's see how much I can fit in there. And then I'm going to leave one little packing cube that will have pants and socks. I'm not taking 14 pairs of socks. Um, he will just probably he won't need 14 pairs of socks. I'll probably take like six or seven. He likes to wear socks and Crocs. Socks and sandals is his, his style, and who, who can blame him, because it is comfy. So let's see if we can get all of that in the packing cubes. Let's pay packing cube, packing cube Jenga. That is a mouthful. I told you these were amazing. The whole of this bed was full, and now it's all in here. So we have clothes, clothes, pyjamas, and um, swimming trunks, and swimming top I like to have them to wear a top so we don't have to worry too much about suntan lotion in here we have a Harry Potter outfit some ears you always need to take a waterproof if you're going to Disney because it can kind of rain in the afternoon so we've got that he's got two hats he's going to wear a pair of crocs on the plane he's going to take a pair of crocs and the small flip-flops upstairs um so let me just show you these 
So got these crocs from last summer. Um, I actually washed them by hand, but people were saying, you can put them in the dishwasher. I didn't know, you might want to Google it, but you can put them in the dishwasher evidently. But I washed them outside and left that side dry. And I got some gibbet, some Disney ones, um, which you can get from Amazon. And they've got quite a few, so they can swap them. I've got Harry Potter ones, they were swapping them. Um, the pack, you don't know what's going to come in the pack. It was from Amazon, you don't know what's going to come in the pack. Um, <clears throat> but there's loads of Disney stuff, Marvel stuff. There's a few Pepper bits and bobs, which I'm going to give to my friend who's got like um, little kids, but love those. So gonna have two pairs of crocs and apart from his underwear that is him done say what that has taken me a while but i feel like <laughs> so i've gone down my list and i've clicked off everything that we've got packed and i'm going to go and transfer this into the case um so i can show you how it all fits in all of this should maybe fit half a side of a case um and i will do that but then when we actually do the cases up i like to swap all the bags because we've mentioned this before i like to make sure if we lose a case somebody's still got some clothes <laughs> i'm always thinking that we're going to lose all the cases right let's put those upstairs very successful afternoon oh my gosh i've just dropped <laughs> the clothes <laughs> up here uh my office is oh gosh it's carnage so let's tidy this up we've got the piles we've got the cases we've just got all the things so come on em you can do this we can do this guys ta-da you see it all fits in one half but um I think I'm going to have to move the hats to another half when I get the other halves done. Uh, we will be taking four cases because obviously we have to take like plugs and toiletries and all that good shenanigans. But there we go. All two weeks worth of clothes for a small boy in half a case. Um, really pleased. Found his old flip flops. Got his old hats. Very, very, very pleased. And also I've had a bit of a bit of a tidy up I did that very quickly so you could see it's still a bit messy over here we'll deal with this in another vlog we've got Stephen mummy my girl piles and I'll pretty much do it the same gonna go through the um, toiletries bag and replenish anything that we need that we didn't bring back from Iceland here are some of my outfits that I'm hanging up um, that I got out of storage, which is why they're a bit crumpled. I need to like steam them, I think. Let me know, is it worth do you, is it worth ironing before I go? These are from last summer. Um so I was thinking of maybe doing a video, getting to do a try on or taking those photos. Mickey and Mickey are happy chatting about all my plans. <laughs> my office is just bonkers. So yeah, I'm hanging these up. I think some of these will just look so cute like this little yellow one i'm gonna get myself some new chub rub shorts i think because the others might i think they've got a hole in this pink one um it's cute on this definitely needs shorts. this is so, i did an instagram roll with this and somebody was like i hope you're gonna wear shorts with that i was like yes i will do so i will do that in a video let me know if you want to do a try on i don't know anything let me know what you want me to show you with my outfits very excited uh, let's get this way instead. <laughs> Doesn't look quite so messy then. It's just this room is just oh that looks that's perfect. Let's pretend the other let's pretend the other scene didn't happen. This room is just the do we call it a catch-all area? This is where Christmas presents are wrapped. This is where um, I do my work. So it's where like blog stuffs kept. It's where I pack. And you know what? I'm really thankful that I've got a little room that I can just kind of at the end of the day shut the door because I know like well, we didn't have that in the other house kind of had the garage but um so I'll just keep packing up here very excited I will bring you along for more packing adventures let me know if you want what else you want me to show you um oh I didn't show you my spreadsheet May I, maybe I can show you that next week with some of our plans uh I talked about Instagram I I'm not going to recommend it because I've, ne I've not used it so I don't want to recommend it because I've not used it but I've got it, so I'll tell you I've got it, and then I'll let you know. Um, I think it's called a Landry card, and it seems to be, 
let me know if you know in the comments it seems to be if you, it costs $25 and then you get the $25 back off your first meal but it means you have like um you don't have to queue up for a few restaurants so um Yak and Yeti in Animal Kingdom, Rainforest Cafe in Animal Kingdom and Disney Springs, the T-Rex in Disney Springs and also Bubba Gump which is universal, they've got one of those in London as well actually. You don't have to queue up for them, you can just turn up and you get a seat. I don't know how it works but I thought if it's $25 and I get my $25 back Oh, you know what is the harm in that and it may and we have not been to the t-rex um restaurant so it would be quite nice to try that out it's absolutely pouring pouring down here thanks so much for joining me along with this little mummin admin task um i feel a little bit more relaxed and every week i'm going to do a little bit more I'll bring you along with me and then we can can be fine and you know what i know that we still have to do tests before we could go. We have to go. And this could all just be a waste of time, but I'm not trying, I'm trying not to think of that. You know, you're just like, just at the back of your mind, I'm sure if any of you are going on holiday or planning holidays or have been on holidays, you're thinking, oh, but I'm just gonna keep, keep going on because I couldn't possibly do all this in the, the day before we go, so. Gonna keep coming out and you're gonna come with me thanks so much see you in the comments i love you lots also uh pop over to instagram because i'm there every day chatting rubbish love you bye